Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Persona 5. I don't know if you guys want to see me go through the whole palace or if you guys care if I just skim through it and just show you the good parts, but I saw a statue behind this door and then I saved it because I was like, whoa, maybe they want to see it because there's like a little mini cutscene right here. So there's a big statue of Kamashita. He's probably compensating for something because that statue is so huge. But Ryuji says, the treasure's up ahead, right? We don't got a choice but to keep going. I guess that's true, but we need to make sure we're ready for whatever might be ahead. What do you think, Joker? Should we continue onward? Eh, I'm level 7. I'll be okay. Usually when they ask you those types of questions, that means you're about to get into a heated battle. Huh? Wait, was that... the gym? This motherfucker. I get it. The gym's some kind of holy place for him. He's a god there. I can't believe he can think like that, especially after what he did to Shiho. God, that bastard makes me so freaking sick! Just you wait, Kamashita! I see. So you're the ones who tampered with the library. It seems my time waiting here has paid off. Just as the ape there said, this place is a holy ground for our great King Kamashita. It is preposterous for miscreants like yourselves to come waltzing in like this. Oh, this guy wants to go? This guy wants to tussle? Alright, you knight with wings. Let's fucking go. I knew this would happen. Well, we don't have a choice. Let's take him down. No problem. I'm level 7. I'm about to send this guy out to the sky, baby. Charge? Heavenly Punisher charged up. Look! He's trying to do something! It's important to guard if you think you're in danger. When you guard... I know what guarding is. I know how to guard. So everybody be on guard. Yeah, just do that. Do that little pathetic little guard. In real life, if you guard like that, guys, that is not going to work. You are still going to get hit pretty hard. I do not recommend trying that in real life. Let's see what he's weak against. Yeehaw. Not bad. Electricity, come on. Fuck. Resist. Wind. It's got to be wind. When you don't know what you're doing, you just got to have a bunch of trial and error. You got to see what fits. Guess see what hits him hard. You know what? Let me try to make this guy sleep. High chance of sleep. Please? Miss? Ah. Uh, I feel like those never work with the big battles like this. But I'm just saying things. I'm just pulling stuff out of my ass. Maybe it does work. Maybe it doesn't. It said high chance of sleep. But it didn't work. Let me try it one more time. And let me have Morgana heal Z. Because we can't let that guy die. He's our main dude. And hopefully this works. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Fuck. See? He's always going after Z. I don't know what his problem is. You got something against me, huh? <clears throat> He's almost dead. Come on, just a little bit more. Heal Z. And then once he charges, I don't think I'm going to guard. I'm just going to go all out. That's what I do, baby. You see? He's about to hit me with a powerful attack. But I'm going to whoop his ass. <clears throat> Here you go, Skull. You got this. <clears throat> yes! Fuck that guy! Damn it. Oh, didn't realize those things could be that tough. Yeah, it looks like he's made a concerted effort to stop us now. Joker, I've helped you learn a few different things so far, but there's no more time for lessons. I'll compile some info you'll need to know for battle, so be sure to take a look later. Okay, so he's not gonna teach me anything? No more tutorials? Thank you! What should we do, head back? Uh... Okay. Oh, shit. There's so many guys. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? I'm going back to the safe room. Where am I? Where am I? Where am I? Oh, my God. I didn't know where I was going. It was so confusing. Oh, of course. Of course you inflict me with sleep. Damn. This is bullshit. What are they weak against? I think the devil guy is weak against gunfire. Yep. But I don't have any more bullets. What about this girl? Uh, are you weak against this? Please? No. Definitely not. Mm, electricity! Take my shocks of justice, you bitches! Bam! And then Ryuji, hopefully you have gun ammo. Yeah, baby. All out, of course. Come on now. Name a more iconic duo than Ryuji and Z. Oh, wait. 
Oh, what? I thought they were going to eliminate them. And why does on when she's like down, why does she look like she's in doggy style position? It's kind of weird. But I'm not complaining. I am not complaining. Should I complain? No, I'm not complaining. Definitely not. Let's take this guy out. Mm. Oh. What? Uh, give me your power, boy. I want that power. All day, every day. I'm gonna head back. There seems to be too many knights. I don't have that much Who's HP there? or SP. So, we're gonna go through a couple days. And then we're gonna beat Kamashita in this episode. I promise you guys. I am not ending this episode till we right. beat that mother sucker. Where the hell do I go? Wait, let me auto recover. Where am I going? Maybe I should go a little yeah, bit so forward. Like, like, I don't wanna progress back. I don't wanna go to the past safe room. Whoa, what was that? You guys heard that? That was random. See it. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, I can get up there. Ooh. Uh, focus. Let's go up here. I love the platforming element that they added in Persona 5. It makes the dungeons way more fun. Like, look at this, guys. I'm just scaling the higher ups of this palace. I love it so much. Where do I go? Treasure chest oh, shit. Spotted. What's Let's up? Grimy gear. Hey, wait. Hey, that stuff is disgusting. You should get it clean somewhere. Anywhere. Wait, wasn't there a coin laundry near LeBlanc? Uh, sure, I guess. Uh. Okay. Cool. That is so freaking awesome. Oh, shit! This dude! Are you kidding me? You freaking troll! I was trying to get that chest, and he was like, nope. He was like, side bitch. He's this. But yeah, guys, let me know in the comments below if you care or not. If I do the whole palace, if you guys want to see how it all works. Or if you just want me to skim through it and get to the boss. Let me heal Z. Because I don't mind showing the whole palace, but I know it's going to take a long time. Because I've been in this dungeon for a while now. And I know that it's going to be a bunch of footage if I show you guys the whole palace. But let me know, because I don't mind. Resist? Uh, hmm. Let's try Buku. Weak. Yes. Yas, bitch. Let me try to use the power of persuasion. Let me talk to him. So that's how it is. You're a bit too weak for me. I'm too big. <laughs> I whooped his ass and I'm too weak. <laughs> Don't make me laugh, girl. Now let's see what's in this chest. Wood clappers. What are those? Resist burn. Who's weak to burn? Is it Morgana? It might be. You notice? Hey, take a look at that. Oh, that matches up with the map. There's no doubt that's the tower we're headed for. So the treasure's up there. Hell yeah, we did it. So, where's the entrance? Of course it's there. All the way up there. And of course people spawn. Ugh, not again. It's no surprise the security would be tight around here. But as they say, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Let's go, Joker. So I gotta do a little sneaky sneaky because I'm freaky. Okay. I got you. I got you. Oh shit, what am I doing? Uh, this sneaking thing is harder than it looks. Because your guy, he just starts spazzing out all over the place. Let's go there. And then I'll wait for him. Bam. Fucking ambush. We can't, we can't go without killing somebody, I think. Might as well be this guy. Weak against Bufu. I remember. You? And you. I really need to work on fusing personas that have all elements. Because I don't think I'm going to have everything with my party. I'm going to have fire, electric, wind, and I need to handle ice. And what? Light, dark, and all the other elements. I, I kind of forgot what they are. Lunge. There you go. And... 
Huggy, I guess. I know you resist it, right? Yeah. Eh, whatever. Losers. Still whoop that booty. Hmm. Nice work, team. All right. Now the hard part. Ooh, level eight. Right. Yay! Level up. Finally. That takes forever, but the hard part is coming up. Okay. We have to try to sneak. Good work. Keep it up. Oh shit! Didn't mean form. to do that. Yes, Morgana and Ryuji leveled up. Way to join the level eight party. Now we just right. need On to catch up. That was so right. easy. I'm yawn. No! Come on, man. Seriously? It ain't opening? The treasure has to be at the top of this tower. Is there any way we can climb up? Focus. Yes, there is. And now we just gotta climb up because that's what we do. Uh, we can go here. Let me see what's over here real quick. Just a barrel? A holy helmet? Holy hell. Let's go this way. This seems to be the right way. Yeah. This is so cool. <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm not saying anything. I'm just like amazed at how improved Persona Jump to Persona 5. Like, if any of you guys have played Persona 4 or Persona 3, you would know that this gameplay has improved. And it's just like, Mwah. It's like, Mwah, hoy. Muy magnifico. I wish I knew more words in a different language than I would say it to. Jump down. Don't mind if I do. I can feel it. I have something. Oh, that's not a thing? Oh, yeah, it is. Well, no, it's not. I just broke it, but there was nothing in there. Wait. What's going on? The distortion is getting stronger. The treasure has to be nearby. Wait, so I'm almost done with this thing? I'm gonna fight Kamashita? Hell yeah, boy! Oh man, there's a safe room right here. Okay, I think I'm gonna go back for today. I'm running out of SP, so let's go. Actually, I'm also gonna fuse Personas because I need a new one. I feel like the ones that I have are kind of weak. I don't have that many in general. I think I have like four or five. But yeah, let me fuse real quick. Excuse me. Do you need something? Yes, let me in here. Create. The inmate needs. Fuse. Fused by results, because I don't know any combinations. Jack Frost level 11? Ooh, I love the Jack family. Barith level 9. Aw, oh, man. Okay, so I got to get up one more level because I'm too underleveled for any of these personas. Okay, never mind. There's only 10 days left before the board meeting. What's the plan for today? Well, the plan is to start a social link with this girl right over here. But we got to upgrade our kindness. Uh, she wants to head in today. Nope. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I need to get ready. I want to learn more about you. No. But I can't because I already tried this in the last episode. Yeah, I need to upgrade my kindness. But let me check these. What are we doing today? What you up to? Oh, yeah, we can hang out with Ryuji. Yeah, let's do that. I want to hang out with my main man, Ryuji. <laughs> Ugh, damn it. I want to move better, but I just can't. I was training for nationals back in the day. But now I totally suck balls. What the hell do you think you're doing? Whoa! Nakaoka? Takeshi? Sounds like two fuckboy names. Running, huh? I saw you from the window. What, you gonna try come crawling back to the track team? Huh? Hell no! Sure. Speaking of which, this was your secret training spot, wasn't it? Well... It's our spot now. You know us, the former track team. We don't even have a locker room anymore, thanks to someone I know. Passive aggressive! Let's not fight. Want to train with us? It's nice to meet you. Mmm. Let's ask them if they want to train with us. You know, we gotta be Z, the peacekeeper. Uh-huh. What the heck is up with this guy? Hold on. Aren't you that transfer student? You're really gonna hang out with this loser? You better watch out. He'll hit you the second he gets pissed off. I heard his dad was the same way. Like father like son, right? Now that's some scary shit. Dude, you're not supposed to say personal <laughs> stuff like that. That don't got anything to do with this. Calm down, Ryuji. Just endure it. I'll shut them up. Yeah, fuck being a peacekeeper. Let's whoop some ass. What? 
Hey, quit it! Huh. Guess you two are pretty similar after all. Look, back then I... I don't need to hear your excuses. Everyone was going through the same bullshit with Kamashita. The beatings, the impossible exercises, but we put up with all of it for the track team. But no, you had to go and fuck all that up! Man, I was stupid forever thinking you were my teammate. That's all I have to say to you. I'm out of here. Wow. I kind of felt like he was in the right there. I don't know why. I nearly smacked him when he was talking about my dad. I haven't changed at all. But you know, you actually helped me calm down a little. I'm glad you were here with me. Thanks, man. Oh, high five! I feel my bond is growing deeper. Oh, yeah! Damn it! I can't get the hang of it. Follow-up. Chance to perform a follow-up attack if Joker's attack does not down the enemy. All right. Good. I got, I'm gonna get the hang of it, guys. The, yes. I'm gonna do it. Let's call it a day. Hey, Nakaoka, why didn't you kick his ass? What? The hell's your problem? Hmm? Now they're just arguing with each other. I should stay out of it. Yeah, that's what you gotta do. Instead of fighting them... You gotta let them fight amongst each other, and then they'll whoop everybody's ass and you won't even get in trouble for it. That is the J way. You guys gotta learn that. The J way. Book in uh, stores in the future. Back. Who's texting me? You know, that palace thing sure is impressive. I mean, it only exists because of how effed up Kamashita is, right? Supposedly. So creepy. Honestly, it's still hard to believe a place like that even exists at all. It don't matter if you believe it or not, though. This opportunity just kind of fell into our laps. We ain't got a choice but to reach out and grab it. You're right. Let's place all our bets on changing his heart. Hey. Sounds like those two are in high spirits. You know, this is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity for you, too. If you want to overturn your current situation, you can't let this chance go to waste. And, you know, if we can't do this situation, then we're going to get expelled by Kamashita. Hey, you got a minute? Something I want to ask you. Come here, let's have a chat. Cool. Yo. Hey, you're free tonight, aren't you? Care to have a little chat with me? What? It's just some small talk. Ooh, we get to deepen our bonds. Sure. Yo. Good. There's a lot of things I want to ask you. I'll clean up, so just wait there. Hey, how's school? You're not causing any trouble, are you? I'm not? Bitch, I might be! <laughs> Should we be sarcastic? You know what? I am. That's the J way. Look here. I've got to report to your probation officer twice a month. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have been joking around then. It's already a pain in the ass as is, so please don't make me have to write even more crap. Got that? This society is kept in check by laws and authority figures. You can go and get yourself killed if you want, but don't go dragging other people into your mess. Last thing we need is more idiots like you roaming around. Hey, I may be an idiot, but I'm your idiot. Booty call. Hmm? What's wrong? Yeah, I'm heading out now. Sorry about that. Oh shit, it really is a booty call. Get it, boy? I know. The usual, right? The usual. Okay. I'll see you later. That person was the usual, and he was smirking As too. As you can see, I'm pretty damn busy both at work and in my private life. I see you, big dog. If you could lend a hand, it'd really be a great help. I'd be glad to. I'm kind of busy. It's too much trouble. I'd be glad to. Now we're talking. Either way, I won't ask you to work for free. If you agree to help me, then I'll teach you how to make the perfect cup of coffee. Not a bad trade, eh? No, that's a super bad trade. What? I want money. I don't want a cup of coffee. I guess. All right. Looks like we got ourselves a deal. The distance between me and Sujiro seems to be closing slightly. Hey, new social link. All right, I'm going to time it just right this time, guys. I'm going to wind it up, and then I'm going to go, yes, when the time comes. It'll be right on the money. You may call yourself a phantom thief, but you're still a minor. Someone had to support you. Furthermore, they did so knowing you were a part of that group. Isn't the owner of that cafe an accomplice of yours? Uh, no. He, he's just here. 
He doesn't know anything. I am thou. That it shall okay, let me wind this up, guys. Let's do it. Ah, damn it, almost. All right. All right. Rank one of the Hierophant Arcana. I'll be counting on your help. See you later. See you later, buddy. Have fun with whoever was on the end of that phone call. See you, big dog. So, Jiro, man. He's a pimp. He's a pimp and he doesn't even know it. Kamashita kun was really in his element at the volleyball rally the other day. You kids are lucky to receive direct instruction from a world famous athlete like him. Sports have been regarded as sacred things that invigorate people since ancient times. So much that the Emperor himself even participated once. Mashima kun, do you know the name of the Roman Emperor who participated in the Olympics? Huh? Um. It's Nero. Ah, it's good to throw yourself into the club activities, but you shouldn't sacrifice your studies. Sorry. Why are you picking on him, man? He's got all these bruises and band-aids on his face. That said, you don't seem too into sports, Zikun. Do you know the answer? What event did Emperor Nero add to the Olympics so that he could participate? Cooking, singing, dancing, bodybuilding. How the fuck am I supposed to know that? I'm pretty sure it's not bodybuilding because bodybuilding, they already have like their small categories in the Olympics. And I'm pretty sure it's not cooking because I don't think they have cooking in the Olympics either, right? And plus, he's an emperor, so I'm pretty sure he had people cooking for him, so he didn't know how to cook. It had to have been singing or dancing. I mean, it's basically a coin flip at this point. Up, down, up, down, up, down. Oh, Incorrect. Of oh, fucking course. I'm amazed that you made it into school like that. The answer is singing. Apparently, Nero was tone deaf, but he ended up winning. The emperor held absolute power, after all. Because of these kinds of selfish actions, not to mention a lecherous side, he became known as a Dispo. No way. Wow. Okay, thank you for making me look stupid, sir. How am I supposed to know that answer, guys? Just imagine going into this game blind. You're not going on the internet to look up the answers. So how are you supposed to know that? I mean, unless you know weird facts like that. Or unless you go to a school where they actually teach you about Emperor Nero. Let's talk to Mishima. See? I never thought it would end up like this. What am I gonna do? I'm done for if Mr. Kamashita keeps coming after me. Don't worry, I'm gonna make everything right in the world, Mishima. And Ryuji isn't even here. Uh, let's talk to this girl right here. What? I don't like the way you walk up to me so casually, like we know each other. Why? I'm sorry. It's not a big deal. Maybe it's not a big deal to you, but it is to me. You probably don't understand how this school works, but angering Mr. Kamashita was a bad idea. All right, you wearing black on black was a bad idea. Okay, um, let me try going into town, upgrading my armor real quick, and then we'll head back into the palace. But before we do that, let's talk to this curious man. Lately, some suspicious guys have been showing up near the airsoft shop at night. They're sneaking around making phone calls, but they're wearing suits. Maybe they're detectives? I just can't bring myself to go to that shop as much anymore. Hmm. Interesting. What's up? I was waiting. Our master awaits. Please come this way. You see what I'm talking about? It, like, sometimes there's dialogue, sometimes there's not. I get confused. Okay, thank you for that. Thank you for the unnecessary ass kicking. <clears throat> so, you've come. How does it feel slipping into the unusual from your usual life? Our master has arranged an access point to assist you in coming here directly from the real world. That door you just went through is it! Be thankful, inmate! This too shall aid in your rehabilitation. Make good use of it. Thank you so much. I wouldn't have found this place without your help. I didn't see a door Focus. protruding from this alleyway. Thank you so much. Okay, let's go inside here. Let's get some guns, let's get some armor, let's get it all. And also, I remember Morgana said that we can actually laundry. So let me go back to Yongen, Cafe LeBlanc, and there should be a laundry mat somewhere nearby. Wait, go here, make a right, and there you go. Hey, hey. 
Oh yeah, didn't you have something dirty? Why don't you try washing it with this? Using the laundromat will cost time to pass, but you will be able to clean dirty equipment you found. Each cycle costs 200 yen. Up to four items can be washed in a cycle. What item you receive is up to luck. Be sure to use the laundromat when you find dirty equipment. Oh, this is new. Okay, so let's wash this grimy gear. You don't have any more dirty items. Do you just want to run the washing machine now? That's kind of a waste, but sure. That's cool. So we can get new armor depending on how we wash it? Hey, hey. The thing is shaking a lot. It would have been nice if you had a washing machine inside your room. Oh, oh it looks like it's done. Ooh, this is much cleaner than I expected. Ancient shirts. Let's head back. Finally, let's head home. I gotta check uh, the stats on that bad back. boy. So, getting used to the city? A little. I see. You're the only one here at night, so I'm not gonna bother setting a curfew or anything like that. So as long as you're taking school seriously, I don't mind if you stroll the streets at night. Ooh. You got that? But only around these parts, got it? You go back on your word, I'll kick you right out. Wait, didn't the guy say that people were being suspicious near that gun shop? Let me actually check that armor real quick, and then we'll head over to that gun place. The thing was called Ancient Shirt. Endurance plus three, a shirt passed down through the generations. Really? Okay, let's go to back streets. And then Shibuya, and then Air Gun Shop. Oh, we can't leave? We can only go around these parts. That is so lame. Oh, whatever. Morgana said to go to the clinic. So let's see what's up over here. You can now quick travel to the clinic. I thought we can go anywhere we want. That is so lame. I should ask her about the enhancing drug I heard her talking about the other day. Oh. What are you here for today? I want that rumored medicine, baby. Huh? Huh? You're the kid who was at LeBlanc. Regular medicine won't do the trick. I have my reasons. Please! I beg you! I have my reasons. <sighs> Fine. Just head into the examination room now. That worked. That was easy. I didn't need to do much persuasion. Oh. That medicine, huh? Whoa. Okay. What are you trying to do? So which conversation of mine did you eavesdrop on to hear that? It was obvious, actually. You call that hiding? Not that I care, of course. I was going to dispose of that medicine anyway. I got a little too carried away with it. But tell me, why would a high schooler like yourself be so interested in that medicine? It's very strange indeed. You don't seem to be very athletic, so... What exactly are you up to? It's for brain power, it's for my exams, it's for studying. I feel like exams would be an answer that she would fall for. Huh? Exams? Oh, your entrance exams for college? So you're looking to improve your concentration and reduce fatigue. Hmm, that's not the best idea. But if that's what you want to do... <laughs> Why does she keep locking and unlocking Take the door? Care. Then good luck with that. I have no obligation to help you with that. Why don't you have an energy drink or something? I need that medicine. You're really annoying, you know that? That medicine is really expensive. And it's not something a high schooler can get his hands on. It costs almost as much as a car. Got it? So how about you just go home? I'm not leaving. Can I work for it? What, like part-time help? Do you consider yourself someone with a good amount of stamina? Whoa, she wants to know my stamina? Okay, I'll show you. I admit I have been looking for a young person around your age to help me out. But I haven't been able to find one, even after putting an ad in the paper. Are you up for it? What would I be doing? How much does it pay? What would I be doing? Do you want to do it or not? I want to know what I'm doing first! Okay then, you'll be participating in clinical trials for my medicine. Hang on, I'll be right back. <laughs> Here you go. Worried about the side effects, huh? Well, you can relax. Rest assured, my autopsy is guaranteed to find out exactly what part of it killed you.
Are you kidding me? Did you change what? your mind? Aren't you gonna take it? The exit's right there if you want to leave. If I don't drink this, Takemi probably won't sell me her medicine. Well, go on. Don't mind if I do. Bottoms up. Well, none of these choices can back me out now, so... Bottoms up. Huh? I can't believe you actually drank it. Bitter yet sour. It's beyond description. However, it's nothing I can't handle. Yeah, you're a boss, Z. Wow, still doing okay, huh? Hmm, not bad for a high schooler. Uh... Uh-oh. Uh-oh! <sighs> well, game over, I guess. What did she just do to us? Good evening. Do you remember anything from the moment you took the medicine until now? Hmm. By the look in your eyes, I'd say you don't. You briefly woke from your coma, but you were completely dazed during the entire examination. You eventually lost consciousness and fell back asleep. <sighs> Are you out of your mind? Only an idiot would have drank that. <laughs> well, Z has balls of steel. I'm not out of my mind. It's for my exams. Yeah, my exams. Fine. By the way, the reason you lost consciousness was because of the taste. It produces a foul smell when it mixes with gastric juices, similar to Sir Streming. <sighs> oh well. All that matters is that thanks to you, I was able to get some good data. Okay, it's my turn to make good on my part of the deal. That's why I waited until you woke up. I don't want the general public to know about my original medicines. So you're strictly prohibited from disclosing what happens here to anyone. Understood? Of course. Same goes for you. Then it's a deal. As long as you come here for it, I'll give you the medicine at a good price whenever you want. I may even add additional selections in time. I look forward to your continued patronage. I've made a deal with Takemi. Ooh, another social link? Yeah, buddy. And I'm not gonna lie, this doctor is pretty sexy. <laughs> pretty cute, She's a little cutie. Considering all the actions you've taken, you must have had someone with medical expertise. Who? And how did you treat your wounds? It'll be easy to find out who if we look into this, you know. Alright, we know this. Death Persona. Increases the selection of healing items at the clinic. Alright. That's useful. So, when can you come back for the next clinical trial? Tomorrow. Oh. You don't remember that part either? Well, I was saying that teenage test subjects are quite valuable in the medical research industry. So I'll provide you the medicine for your entrance exams, and in exchange, you'll be my guinea pig. <laughs> guinea pig. I have to perfect this medicine. That word's always funny to me. Guinea pig. If you're able to move now, you can go home. All right. Take care. Bye. Bye. I feel like cooperating in that shady clinical trial has increased my guts. I need guts. Definitely need guts. I need to increase everything. That looks pathetic. That was the smallest star in the history of stars. You guys saw that? Oh, I was almost embarrassed to show you guys that. But I've been thinking, and I don't know if I can beat Kamashita in this episode. I know in the beginning I promised that I would fight Kamashita, but a lot of things have went down. Well, then. I hear good things about that Sunday TV shopping show. Want to check it out? Today's Sunday. Where should we meet to head to the palace? The rooftop will work. Want to be locked? Eh, should be fine. It's always open. And worst comes to worst, we can just go somewhere else. Mmm, got it. Anyway, what's our plan for today? I'll go... I'm still thinking. Let us know once you make up your mind. Let me water my plant. I told you guys to remind me in the comments, and you sure did. That's why I love you guys. We thought it looked nice, but it looks a bit dead. It's only been a couple days. Don't they sell nutrients or something that'll bring some color back to it? Yeah, sure. Hey. You're going to get expelled if you don't steal Kamashita's heart. Make sure you don't forget that. You know what? Fine. We're going to go to the hideout. 
We're gonna get into some tussles. We're gonna get into some fights. And I think I'm gonna fight Kamashita in the next episode. Because this episode, I'm looking at it right now, it's running pretty long. I'm gonna avenge Shiho no matter what it takes. Yep, let's infiltrate the palace. Ugh, seeing this face pisses me off every goddamn time. This statue? No, it might be dangerous to tamper with. Let's keep going for now. Oh, never mind. Whoa, that was close. Wait, what is this? It's a classic security measure. My tail might be in danger if we try to force our way through. Oh yeah, same for panthers. So what do we do? No way we're getting through here as is. Uh, pull this. Hey, look. Yo, you think this controls those swinging things? There's no reaction. Mm. I didn't think it would be that easy. We'll probably need some kind of key for it. We gotta look for a key again? What a pain in the ass. Where would it be, though? There weren't any suspicious rooms on the way here. Joker. Hmm, what do you think, Joker? There has to be a hidden room. An enemy has the key. We don't need a key. An enemy probably has the key. Mm. Huh, that probably Indeed. would be the most likely scenario. An enemy? You mean one of them shadows that's roaming around? No way, Dude, man. how many of them do you think there are? We can't beat the crap out of all of them. The key is for this tower, so it would have to be one of the shadows around here. On top of that, it would have to be a relatively high-ranking one. Then we just need to look for shadows like that and defeat them! That's Let's do this, Joker. We need to find that shadow with that key. Uh, alright. Can't go here. Big-ass walls. That guy right there looks different from the rest. So let me wait for him to come this way. And here we go. Whoa. That's a big bitch. That is a big bitch. Uh, Zio? Yes! Thank you. What is that? Uh, make him sleep. Yes! I finally did it! Alright, Ryuji, you got this, buddy. Damn, that guy was pretty strong. I need to level up before I fight Kamashita, because if I can't even handle these guys without losing anybody, then I don't even know what to do. And I'm level 9, so I can fuse personas. That's what I'm going to do before I end today's episode. I'm going to fuse a persona. Randy Right Eye. Yeah. Hey, that shadow did have something, but what the hell is this, an eye? Oh, I just figured it out. This must be how we stop those sights. Oh yeah, now that I think about it, the statue didn't have eyes. <sighs> Ugh, how much grosser can he get? So this is gonna stop those things, huh? Well, we'll need one more. Okay, Another go. guard captain probably has it. Let's try checking the other floors, Joker. Oh. Crap, they all look like high-ranking soldiers. Are we gonna have to be all of them? That would work. But there should be a one actual guard captain among them. Joker. Do you have any way to tell them apart? Yes, I do. I have a third eye. And it's that guy right there. The one that's glowing in all white. So let's see here. Uh, I can't go that way? Why not? Focus. Fuck. Okay. Guess I'm gonna have to fight these guys one by form. one. There we go. Um, hopefully he has the same weakness as last time. Let's do cleave. Ooh, nice! Batter up! Mm. I love when they do that. Just made the battle like ten times easier. And we get to do it again. Well, that was easy. All right, so we got the right eye key, got the left eye key. Now we can stop those scythes from swinging and chopping our asses up. Let's do this. We have both eyes now. Try putting them in, Joker. Use the eyes. Hold off for now. Why would I choose that? Yeah, yank them out. 
Nice. All right. All right. We can get across. Yay. All right, Kamashita. Time to get that ass whoop, boy. Wait, there's somebody right there. Ooh. Revival bead. That's good because I don't have any revival skills. And I don't even think I have any revival items. I mean, I'm not planning on dying or losing anybody in this boss fight. But we'll see, guys. We'll see. Okay, we're in. Quiet down, you idiot! There he is. Oh shit, it's Kamashita! No! And a ton of soldiers! How have you not captured the intruders yet? I apologize, my liege. Okay. I bet he'd go. never imagined we're in the same room as him. Come on, let's keep moving. We gotta keep quiet, guys. We gotta keep quiet. We just gotta do the power sneak walk, like Z's doing. Oh, what is this place? Holy shit! That treasure thing's gotta be in here. Hey, what is this? It's floating in the air. <laughs> That's the treasure. We finally found it. Yes. Are you sure? That cloudy thing? You sure about that, buddy? Just hold on a second. I was planning on telling you more once we made it this far. Simply finding the treasure isn't enough. We'll need to make it materialize before we can steal it. What do you mean? Desires have no physical form by nature. Hence, we'll first need to make the real person aware that their desires are in fact a treasure. Once they're conscious that their desires might be stolen, the treasure will finally show itself. But how do we do that? We warn them. Tell them, we are going to steal your heart. Nice. So we're gonna send a calling card? Oh, that's totally what a phantom thief would do! Once we do that, the treasure will appear for certain. Uh, I think. That again? Either way, sounds like it's worth giving it a shot. Our infiltration route is secure. All that's left now is to pump out a calling card in reality, then come back to take the treasure. All right, sounds like Let's a plan. Set, huh? Let's do this! That's the spirit. Once we send out the calling card, there will be no turning back. Just let me know when you're ready. We'll head back to the hideout and send out that calling card. The infiltration route has been secured. All that remains is to send the calling card to Kamashita. Ooh, that's it, guys. All right, so next episode, we are going to fight Kamashita, but I'm going to send the calling card before we do that. We've secured our route, so what should we do now? Do you want to head out for today? Yeah, let's leave. Hey? Yeah, let's get the hell out of here before Kamashita finds us. Yeah, I'm gonna send out the calling card because I want to see what it looks like. I'm curious. I don't want to make you guys wait another episode. And also, I said that we're gonna fuse a persona. So let's get in there and let's do some fusey fusey. Let me see what this guy looks like. I see. Bufu. A strong persona. Indeed. Strong against the gunfire. Weak against fire. Strong against ice. He looks pretty cool. But let me check McCoy. I see. A strong persona uh, indeed. This Gumby looking dude. Nah. What about him? Not terrible, but not impressive. Snap, Secunda. Eh, he doesn't really know anything. These personas are kind of whack. I'll be good. I'm good, guys. Done already. Let's go back and let's send that calling card. Finally time. All right. All are that's left now is to send out the calling card and take Kamashita's heart. Couldn't we have just sent one at the beginning of all this? It's not that simple. A treasure won't stay materialized forever. Once the impression is gone, the treasure will disappear. I think it'll last around a day at most. The hell? That's like no time at all. Anyways, we can send a calling card right now, yeah? Let's do it and steal that bastard's heart. Now then. The palace will go away once you take the treasure. Make sure you've done everything you need to do. All right, I'm gonna do it. I'm ready, baby. So let's send the calling card. Let's do it. I've been waiting to hear you say that. That bastard's going down. Tomorrow's finally the day. So we send the calling card in the morning and carry out the plan by the end of the day, right? Correct. 
The effect won't last that long. Are you worried? <laughs> Waited too long. Perfect. We're going to pull this off no matter what. So, who's going to write the card? Leave it to me! Why? Why? Why wouldn't it be me? This is important. Are you sure you can handle the pressure? I must agree. I really want to get him good. Let me write it. Uh, come on, please. All right. Write whatever you want. You sure you can do it? Write whatever you want, baby. Gotcha. I got a hundred things I want to hurl at that bastard rattling around in my head. Just make sure it's not obvious who wrote it, all right? I know, I know. All right, then. Tomorrow it is. You better not slack off on this. A calling card? I heard it was already posted by the time everyone got here this morning. Sir Suguru Kamoshida, the utter bastard of lust. <laughs> we know how shitty you are, and that you put your twisted desires on students that can't fight back. That's why we have decided to steal away those desires and make you confess your sins. This will be done tomorrow, so we hope you will be ready. From the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. Wow. Not bad, huh? I looked up a bunch of similar stuff online for reference. Um, yeah. I know what you wanted to say, but it sounded like an idiot trying to be an adult. Your logo's a little lacking, too. Okay, you know what? That ain't true. Did Mr. Kamashita do something wrong? Does this mean the rumors are true? Wait a sec. Is someone gonna take something from Mr. Kamashita? What's with this weird logo? And who are these Phantom Thieves of Hearts people? It got everyone excited, so it's all good, yeah? Who's responsible for this? Look at that. A predictable reaction for someone who knows what we mean by distorted desires. I think it's hitting him pretty hard. Did you do this, or was it you? Was it you two? What are you talking about? What if it was? Garbage. It's not a problem. You'll be expelled soon enough anyway. Come, steal it if you can. Okay. Alright guys, you heard the man. He said, come steal it if you can. We're gonna do that in the next episode. So if you guys are excited to see that as Judging soon as possible, response, I'll wait for this. I'm sure we had an effect on his palace. Does that mean the treasure's appeared? We'll be able to get it today, right? It's not just today. It's only today. The impact of seeing a calling card doesn't last long. And it cannot be repeated. This will be our one chance to steal the treasure. One day's more than enough for us. The calling card has been delivered to the target. Alright guys, we sent out the calling card. We are going to go into Kamashita's palace in the next episode. If you want to see that as soon as possible, make sure you give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is dead too!